What brahmacharya means is, literally it means brahman and charya. Brahman means the ultimate, charya means you're on the path of the ultimate. When we say brahmacharya, this is particularly relevant in terms of sadhana. There are other ways for the feminine, but particularly relevant to the masculine or the male body because the seed of life that is in a man, if he is willing to transform this, when I say the seed of life, a single cell which is able to create another human being. The capacity of the man to be able to transform this into a life force is like an atomic force. If you can take an atom and release it, a single atom can create so much energy, just like this. But the same capability is not in a woman's body because it's a compulsive cycle. If she does not make use of it to produce a child, she will lose it anyway. She cannot hold it in her body, she cannot make use of it in any sense because it dies periodically. But what is referred to as virya, to transform this is brahmacharya. So you will see at various times, people say we cannot fight with him because he is a brahmachari. This does not mean that he is just willing to die, just that, no. It is just that they cannot kill him because every seed in his body he has transformed it into a fresh life. And the nature of his life is so big that it is no more as mortal life is generally. So it is from this context, it is being said, Bhishma had the power to choose his time of death because he not just… he did not just take a, take a vow and deny himself something, he made use of this opportunity to transform the seed within himself into a live life force through which he almost became mortal by choice. He is not immortal, but he can choose his mortality. He can choose the time and place of his mortality, which is partially as good as immortality. Immortality can only happen to you if you are cursed. <laughs> yes, <laughs> if you live forever, can you believe it? <laughs> the torture of it? No. Immortality is a curse. Choice of being able to die when you want to die is a boon 